Alright my peeps, I'm here with some more, you know what it is, prediction game videos, it is Del Rio versus Dolph Ziggler for the World Heavyweight Championship at Money in the Bank, it's a match you're going to see this Sunday, uh, so, this matchup, the rematch between Dolph and Del Rio, first one being uh, at Payback where Dolph was the champion, Del Rio challenger, roles reverse now where you've got Dolph the challenger and Del Rio the champion, and also on top of that, yeah, the, the roles are further reversed since you've got Dolph right now as the face and Del Rio as the heel where previously you had Del Rio as the face you, you get the point so uh, <laughs> this matchup this is it's not the hardest match to predict on the card definitely not because of course you've got two money to make a lot of matches which both have well one of them has seven competitors and the other has six Maybe seven once they announce a replacement if they announce a replacement uh, But 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 it's still It's it's still it's not too obvious this matchup uh, I, I could still see Dolph winning I could see Del Rio winning well Del Rio in fact is my choice to win this matchup But but I'm not completely ruling out a Dolph Ziggler victory uh, I could see him you know potentially winning it on money in the bank actually let me start with Dolph you know he won his Money in the Bank briefcase, the same thing that allowed him to become world champion at Money in the Bank last year. So maybe, ju just cause, just because of that, uh, uh, just for a cool thing to talk about or whatever, they could have Dolph win back, or you know, win the World Heavyweight Championship at the same pay-per-view he won, at the same pay-per-view, he won the Money in the Bank briefcase, which allowed him to get that World Heavyweight Championship in the first place. And on top of that, if the goal of Del Rio and Dolph was just to switch them, switch roles with them, uh, you know, have Dolph as a face, Del Rio as a heel, then, you know, they've already done that. So, yeah, well, you know, I, I would think if that was the only goal and it was just to get Dolph face really quickly and Del Rio heel really quickly, uh, quickly, sorry, then, you know, I assume this, it would be safe to make the switch again, to have Dolph win back the World Heavyweight Championship. The only issue with that, I think it's too soon, it's, he's not, he's a face, but he's not, he's still aligned with some heels, he's still aligned with AJ and Biggie Langston, uh, so, so, in, in some ways, you could say Dolph is not fully a face, just, just yet, um, so I would think maybe Dolph would, you know, first get away from AJ and Biggie Langston and then maybe world, win back the World Heavyweight Championship from Del Rio if he is going to win back that championship from Del Rio. Uh, I mean, once when, when Big Show won that championship, won the world title off of Sheamus, I thought Sheamus would win it back at some point from the Big Show, but he never did. So maybe this is the same case here, but uh, ho hopefully not. Hopefully Dolph does win back that championship off of Del Rio, but who knows, you know, uh, who even knows if he does lose this one, if he gets a rematch at SummerSlam or not. Anyways, yeah, back to what I was saying, uh, I'm thinking before Dolph wins back the world championship, he has to get rid of AJ, he has to get rid of Biggie Langston, he has to be on his own, uh, because AJ is pretty much the biggest heel right now in the Divas division, and Biggie Langston is you know, another heel, he's a heel manager, he's a heel bodyguard, why would a face need, need a heel bodyguard or manager? And uh, also, they're kind of teasing that there's some tension between AJ and Dolph, I mean AJ hasn't been, you know Dolph even on Ross pointed out to AJ that she hasn't been with him in his matches, she hasn't come out with him to support him or whatever, and it just seems like, you know, sooner or later, most likely sooner, definitely sooner I'd say, AJ, either AJ is going to turn on Dolph, or Dolph is going to tell AJ that he doesn't want her uh, with him anymore, and say, same with Biggie Langston. A good way to get Dolph away from AJ and have him, you know, go on his own, is they could have AJ cost Dolph this matchup, either by accident or on purpose, because, I don't know, she's mad at him or something like that, if, if she cost him the matchup, Del Rio could retain his championship, and in the process, you could finally, you know, you could finally have Dolph Ziggler as a full-on face because he's no longer associated with, you know, two heels. 
Uh, so pretty much, you know, so far, all of the reasons, a, a lot of the reasons, uh, you know, point to Del Rio retaining his championship. Uh, and Dolph Ziggler, you know, getting away from AJ. Also, you can have Del Rio, I mean, you could have Dolph winning this matchup by this qualification or countouts. And that way, Dolph still wins the matchup, so he would get a rematch, I would assume. And Del Rio would still be the champion, so he'd still hold the World Heavyweight Championship. And then you could have, you know, one final match, a blow-off match at SummerSlam or something like that, where Dolph wins. But then again, if he wins, then the former champion gets a rematch, so they would have another match. It's, it's a bit complicated, but... Uh... Yeah, I, I, I'm pretty sure Del Rio is going to win this one. And I think AJ is going to be part of the reason that Del Rio wins. Uh, like I said, either by mistake, maybe she gets in the way accidentally or something like that. Or maybe in on purpose, maybe she just turns on Dolph or something like that. Or actually, you can have both Big E Langston and AJ cost Dolph the matchup uh, at the same time. So you kill like two birds with one stone or something like that. Anyways, that is pretty much it for my detailed prediction. I'm sticking with Del Rio winning this one and retaining his title. Maybe Dolph will get it at SummerSlam or further down the line. But uh, anyways, that's pretty much it. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. And if you did, as always, you can click that like button down below. I'd really appreciate it. And with that said, I'm out, guys. See ya.